Oh, I'm so bored. I know what we can do. We can create a country. You guys can learn how to create a country. A working country. Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a nice country. And uh, don't take this literally in real life. But, guys, it's your opinion what you can do in the world. It's gonna, it's depending on the world or server. So, I'm, I'm going to be showing you three steps how to make a country. Uh, one of the steps is right behind me. Mm, a flag. So, let's go into the first step. So, for my country, my country is going to need land. So, I, I want to pick out this desert area. This is going to be my country, right? So, let me just show you a line of it. Okay? This is my country, right? The capital is going to be here. So... I'm gonna divide it into, and here's the most important guys. You have to have states. So, US has about like 50 states, I think. Okay, so we are going to just divide it. We're gonna have two states. One holds our capital, and one is just a random place. So, so now we divided our states. Let's go to the second step. We are back to my little chair. I know. Cool, right? So, next thing on the list... Next thing on the list is flags. Every country has flags. Guys, can you guess these? Five flags. Comment down all five flags. Okay, this one you can have to type. You can look at this one. This one, this one, and this one. Okay, back to the big. So, the use of having flags is to show your the symbol of the country. A flag is a symbol of a country, right? So, my my country, right? I'm gonna create my country. Uh, my country is going to. Like, my country symbol is going to be different, okay? So, I created my flag. It's this symbol, I know. But then after, it's, I just took the idea of the Japanese flag, put the circle here instead of being red, like ripping it off. And then after, I used the Russian thing. So... flag here okay okay kind of looks similar to these two flags no okay so on to the next step so your next is to name your country okay so it can be anything right if you want your country to be named something like of your natural terrain uh, just go for something like uh, like let's say there's a lot of lakes in my country so I'll name it. So my country was just named Lakeland, okay? That's the best I can come up with. That's the best I can come up with. 
So my 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 name. So this entire land area is named Lang. Lake Land, Lake Land. Since it's, they could have named it Desert Land since it's like practically a desert. But nah, I don't wanna take it. And that's why I was gonna name it Lake Land because we got some water. So, so you know what? I pick land at the back of the thing because land or ear means uh land of the what okay i learned this in the in this video link will be in the description if you want to watch it i got all this information from this video so yeah so so it means lands of the what your name is so mine is lands of the lake mine is lands of the lake and that was the final step so guys that was the final step to creating your country. Hey man, I know, I know man. Don't worry, don't worry. I'm your new leader.